Hi, and welcome to another fun episode of Storytime with Mr. Steven. Today, we are going to dive into a new fun and fresh book inspired by Will Smith, the Fresh Prince himself. And that book is The Fresh Princess. I can't wait to dive into this book and let's see what adventures The Fresh Princess goes on. Are you guys ready? Well, are you guys ready? Wait, did you guys notice my shirt? Story time. Come on now, how fresh is that? Now, are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Well, let's dive in. Fresh Princess, written by Deneen Milner, illustrated by Gladys Jose. This is Destiny. Her dad calls her princess, his fresh princess. Destiny likes a lot of things that princesses like. Poofy dresses and sparkly shoes, shiny crowns, her princess throne, and her loyal subjects too. She's also really good at being really fresh. That means she's brave, has her own style, and is super smart. She shines like a new penny. Most days, being fresh is a good thing. Like when Destiny's big sister Marley teaches her how to double dutch and Destiny jumps and trips and struggles and jump back in again. Cool as she pleases until she's got it licked. Today, Fresh Princess is not feeling fresh at all. That's because her family is moving to a new house in a new city. It is far away from everyone she knows and everything she loves. Destiny is not happy about that. Her dad tries to make it all better. That's his thing. Boo-boos get band-aids. Belly aches get soft rubs. Sleepy heads get good night kisses. On this day, Getting back to feeling joyful takes way more work. Her heart will need more to fill in the empty spaces where her happy used to be. Destiny perks up a little when she sees her new room. It has potential, she says to herself. She imagines the magnificent city she'll build there, the fancy luncheon she'll host, and the new throne that will be the centerpiece of her new castle. Destiny finds her new favorite place where the daylight greets her every morning and the stars wink at her each night. She perks up a little more when she looks outside. Destiny listens as the rhymes as the double dutch rope skips a beat across the concrete. The jumpers swing their hips and watches the ropes. Then they take flight. Destiny thinks it might be fun to jump in, but those kids are good, really good. So for now, she just watches. Her dad wants to help his fresh princess feel at home, so he invites her on a big adventure. One of his favorite things to do when he was a kid in this neighborhood was to ride the L train. Speeding at the top of the city makes me feel like the king of the world. Dad says, let's go see your new kingdom. Madam, your royal carriage. Destiny takes Dad's hand, climbs the steps, and prances down the aisle to her royal seat. She wiggles as the train picks up speed, whistling and whirling through West Philadelphia. Along the way, Destiny's dad points out the love letters tucked on the building's rooftops and spines. Keep your head to the sky, Fresh Princess, he says as they roll on by. Destiny waves and blows kisses as the building salute her by passing. She does love what she sees, but still, she aches for home. Back at their new place, 
The kids are playing double dutch again. One of the girls flashes a smile and invites her to join. Destiny says, no thanks. She is not ready for her public, not yet. Maybe soon. Why are you not playing double dutch? Asks Marley. You are just as good a jumper as anybody here, she says with a smile. What if I fall on my face? Asks Destiny. It wouldn't be the first time. Plus, you just get back up. You're the fresh princess. Destiny thinks about this and realizes she can do it. So she grabs her sparkly sneakers and decides to get out there and show them how it's done. Can you jump? Asks one of the girls. She says her name is Mary. Destiny gives a slow yes. Come jump with us, says Mary. Mary introduces Destiny to the block. There's Shani and Aset, Zoe and Zion, Miles and two Lilas. <coughs> Finally, it's her go. Destiny takes her place next to the ropes as the Turners swing their arms. Destiny takes a deep breath, swings her hips to the beat, and like the brave fresh princess, jumps in. And the happiness she feels in this very moment, jumping high and free, surrounded by her new friends, is the freshest of all. The end.